What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Let's Play Yoshi's Island with the Viva Legetti, of course, and that is me. Gonna try something yeah. a bit different today by recording with no sound playing. But um, today has been a very eventful day for me. I've gotten 200 video views on just all of my random crap, and I've also gotten my first subscriber. So yay for subscribers. That's very cool, in my opinion. But I'm moving straight along with this, trying not to get killed. This is one of those annoying levels where you have to um, pay attention because the level's moving as you go along. And I don't like these levels in particular because I always stuff them up and die. So you might get to see a fair bit of fail in this episode. However, you might not because I did have a practice run through before and I did die a fair bit. I died, got game over a couple of times. That's how bad it was. So hopefully we don't do that horribly. But um, yes, moving back on, I've just finished recording a let's, I mean a um, pay-per-view prediction for the Elimination Chamber. So if you're into wrestling and that kind of stuff, like I am, you might want to check out that. So yeah, that's just another thing to have a look at if you're into that kind of stuff. Um, hopefully. This video doesn't go for as long as the last one did because I've shown it to a couple of people and one of them did say to me try to get a lot more energetic which I thought I was doing but apparently not and also try to cut the video's length down because it was too long so try to work on that sorry if the video was too long last time I don't even know what my am hey I just got a middle ring just teabag the ground a bit so yeah apparently the video was too long Thank you for sh sh bleh, kind of speak. Thank you for um letting me know that. But um, hopefully this one won't be as long and filled with as much fail because I was trying to learn the controls last time. Because it's just one of those things where I was just recording it pretty much the same day where I got the game. And I've got to say it's an amazing game because Yoshi itself is amazing even though I'm a very weird purple color and I just got a one up. I'm recording this at roughly 10.13 at night time. So everyone in my house is trying to sleep and this is the only time during the day I pretty much got to myself. At, because everyone in my house is one, like, we're one of those families how it's like, we're a family and we do stuff together but it's kind of annoying if I want to do some recording or go play my Xbox or Don't You Dare Die or play my PlayStation because like they always want to do something. Which I'm cool with, it's just, if I'm trying to record or do something else on my YouTube channel, it's kind of a distraction. But we got through that with one life, that's actually pretty cool, because as I said, last time when I tried this, I died a fair bit. And let's, ah, uh, we only got three flowers. Oh well, that's better than zero. So yes, moving straight on into the next level, once I can move on. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. 69 points, heh, <laughs> lol. Yeah, so we have a total of 390. Yeah, back to what I was saying, I've also had to go back and redo some of those other levels because I forgot to save it at the exact same part because I'm an idiot. And we've got some shy guys on stilts. Which means I'm probably going to stuff it up because I always forget that they're on stilts and just try to eat them like that. Yeah, no more shy guys. Played Skyrim for the first time today, and that's a pretty cool game. Jump, you moron. Skyrim's pretty cool. And I know a lot of you people out there have already played it and probably finished it, but I never really got into Oblivion, which is probably going to seem really weird for most of you because Oblivion and Fallout have always been amazing, according to my friends. Okay, now, last video I said that the red eggs contained red keys, which is not, uh, red coins, which is not true. The flashing eggs contain the red coins. So, sorry for getting that wrong. I actually learnt that last night when I did a play, quick playthrough to try to get a bit more skill at this game, which I think worked. So, yeah, that's just one little thing I stuffed up. But I'm still not very good at this at the moment, so... Hopefully the skill will progress as we progress through the game. 
because usually that's what happens. You start off playing crappy, and then you just get amazing skill levels. Kind of like a Pokemon. When you first start playing that, you don't know what's going on. You don't know what matches up against what. Like you think fire types are good to match against ground types or something. Then you learn that is a very, very bad combination. But yeah, so I've actually decided that starting on the day that this Yoshi video is uploaded, that is going to be the week that I start my schedule. So if you haven't actually seen my schedule yet, you should probably check out that video, which I might leave a link in the description. I might not. So just have a look down there. So yeah, so the subscription, the damn it, I missed King Red Coin. The link will probably like just tell you that my Yoshi's Island videos will be coming out on Monday. My Anna Plus videos will be out on Friday, and random crappy stuff that I do during the week will be out on. I think it was Wednesday and um, Tuesday and Thursday are just going to be reserved for comments, replying, um, messages, going to lose this effing seedy kid. Thank you. No more seediness, you dumb seedy kid. And if we can get this in there, oh, we did. We get some flowers. I mean stars. Somebody, actually that's a lie. I figure that they do kind of look like flowers, but they are actually, in fact, stars. Because stars are amazing, apparently. And when I played through that before, I forgot to ground pound all the way down there on that, which I just did, and apparently there was nothing down there, so that was kind of a stoop. Damn it, we keep missing that coin. Let's try that one more time. Got it. So yeah, like, I got told that... I didn't actually get told, but there's that red coin. So yeah... I'm sorry if my voice sounds a bit weird because I'm fairly bit tired and and I'm just going to need to get a new mic fairly soon because this one's not very good and if we go down there we can go down here now stuff this up yesterday when I tried it try it again I'm pretty sure there's no red coins so I don't bother going for the coins off the top of my head from yesterday Go you transforming Yoshi, because Yoshi is a ditto, as I did say, if many of you recall the last video. Don't know how Yoshi's a ditto, but apparently this one is the same color, so therefore it has ditto skills. Okay, I don't know where the flower that I continuously missed is, but hopefully I'll figure that out if I decide to go back and play this again, which I might not, but I might. But I'm... Um, the one thing I don't like about this Yoshi's Island is in number two you can actually get like different babies. So each baby's got a different ability, like you can get baby Wario, baby Bowser, baby Peach, Mario, Donkey Kong. Yeah, but probably the best one out of those is still probably baby Mario, but at least the different babies have different abilities. So like you can get I think it was Bowser to breathe fire yeah, it was Bowser. Bowser to breathe fire, you can get um he can also do like a elbow crush looking thing that's actually pretty helpful. It can clear through. I'll show you if I can find something that it can clear through besides enemies, obviously. But um, and you can do a ground pound that would just instantaneously make those stalk things go all the way down with the one pound instead of um the multiple pounds. And I don't know what just happened there, so we'll just continue on. But, um, yeah, like, probably Baby Mario saw the best out of him, and, like, each of their eggs have different abilities, like, Mario's egg does, like, bounces off walls, Peach's just breaks on the first throw, and about Bowser's bounces, Wario's bounces, you can never play as Baby Luigi, and Donkey Kong's explodes like it's a grenade, which is pretty cool. Don't exactly know how an egg can become a grenade. Hey, we've got 87 coins. I'm pretty sure that's our record so far. Missing three coins and one flower. And I'll do one more level because we're still doing fairly well on time. I'm pretty sure it's up to about 11 minutes. So we'll do this one more level, then we'll turn the video off. And as soon as I just noticed what this video was called, I probably shouldn't be doing this video because it's my least favorite in this first world. 
called Touch Fuzzy Get Dizzy. Sounds like Yoshi's going to be a stoner, which he kind of is because I'm probably I'm definitely not going to be able to avoid them. But later on in this video, get back here, you seedy Mario kid. Later on in this, you got to be kidding me. Getting erupted by a crying effing baby again. Stop it. Give me that kid. Thank you. Yeah, later on in this video, there are things that are called fuzzies, which look kind of like a spore. And if Yoshi touches them, he becomes a stoner slash... Hey, a flashing egg. A stoner, a drunk person, a... Pretty much Mario, but he doesn't get side effects when he eats his mushrooms. If you think Mario is a stoner, you should like this video. Because we all know that Mario is in fact a stoner. Hey, I got watermelon seeds. Which means I can't lick at the moment. Where did I get that watermelon from? If anybody knows where I got that watermelon from, you should tell me because I did not see it. Come on, give me that. Thank you. I didn't even see him that time. You've got to be joking. Dodge him. Thank you. We did it. Getting the red coin. Don't get hit. Don't get hit. Don't get hit. Don't get hit. Ah, oh, thank you. Now I can't get this coin. Unless I throw an egg. Yeah. That. Eggs for the win. Ah. Die. It's like Bullet Seed from Pokemon. If you don't like Pokemon, then I don't care. Pokemon is amazing. Just ask anybody who had a Game Boy Color or Game Boy Advance when they were playing Pokemon Red, Blue, Yellow, Crystal, Gold, Silver. They were amazing. Like one of the best. Actually, they probably are the best generation of Pokemon games because if you remember correctly, there was originally 150 for all to see to be a Pokemon Master. We just got eaten. That's not good. We need to get that flashy egg. Where'd the flashy egg go? Oh, okay, crappy, we lost the flashy egg. And this is Yoshi when he's touched the fuzzy. And we can eat the fuzzy. And he just farts it out like a pop. But as you can see, it does make the screen go blurry. And it is fairly, a little bit hard to control on some occasions. And if you touch it, it just pops, obviously. But um, there's a level later on in this game where the fuzzy's back, but there's a lot more areas where you can fall off an edge and it's not very helpful and for some reason we can't stop running in that same direction so let's just sit still for a second and aim an egg upward and collect the flowers that come out I mean stars sorry my bad might as well just stay drunk because drunk Yoshi is cool and a bit hard to control but remember if Mario grew up around stoners, that would explain why Mario becomes a stoner. And alcoholics. Um, we'll just call it a drug. Don't fall off the fucking edge. Thank you that I didn't. Ah, what's in there? We just get some stars and one fell off the edge, so I'm not going to bother collecting that. If you guys heard that, that was me cracking my ankle. Because my feet are amazing. But um, yeah, we got some red coins down here. And later on in this game, obviously like a Mario ones, if you go in there, there's probably going to be a massive fish that's going to eat us. Because, honestly, hey, that was a... What was that? I didn't even know what he got up here. What's up here? We got a chomp rock. Don't know what that's going to do. We got flower dudes. If somebody could figure out what to do down here, that would be amazingly helpful. So let's first move this, let's find out. Move, move, move. Hup, anything there? Nope. There we go. What do we get? Yeah. Ah, that's a beanstalk. Sunflower, beanstalk, whatever you want to call it. Beanstalk and Mario, probably a flower in this. Ah, are they edible? Uh, nope, okay. Don't need to worry about those things killing me then. Probably the hidden flower up here too. Nope, okay, mate, maybe. No, just some flower, um, stars, not flowers. There we go, we just got the, probably not the last red coin, but a red coin nevertheless. Get back here, Mario, stop hallucinating. 
Give me that. Thank you. That's a very peaceful area with butterflies. Ah, this thing. 80s flowers. Give me that. Thank you. Collect some eggs. You can't kill those things by jumping on them. You need to eat the eggs. I mean, the eat the. I don't even know what they're called, but eat them. Haha, -ha, we got all of the flowers. So hopefully we can get a mini game. Nope. Okay, well, seeing as though we didn't get the mini game, that is going to be all for this video. Be sure to subscribe. And feel free to check out my older videos. And as for now, I am out. So. Bye, guys.